Hello, everyone. Welcome back to SnowRunner New Game Plus mode. New Game Plus, we're just having fun, messing around, and we are just uh, cheating our butts off. <laughs> I hope everyone's doing good, and today we are going to do Tin Hut, which is, we'll go ahead and start tracking. We need to repair the Drummond Island Bridge. So, we need uh, several different items. First the thing we need is a set of metal beams and a, a set of concrete slabs. Which is right here on this big flatbed. So, what we're going to do is jump into our Western Star old reliable truck. We're going to disengage and we're gonna get moving uh, I hope everyone's having a good day today having a lot of fun doing the uh, snow runner videos just mess around If any of my videos is actually helping, maybe with some players that might be having a little trouble, and uh, that's great. There is plenty of content to be made and videos to be shared with this game, which is now three years going strong. The old white western star here is one of the best trucks for the Michigan maps. This could be a little bit longer episode than normal. Uh, we'll see how long it takes me to get through this mission done, but we're going to keep it going and complete it in one video. <laughs> Here's our flatbed trailer. I believe those are concrete slabs. Should be. We'll get turned around here. Oh, sorry about your fence, buddy. We all have to make sacrifices. <laughs> Let it hook our trailer up. And off we go. Put our diff lock on, might help us. And we'll just uh, slowly make our way out, take our time. Flip. Don't flip. 
Ah. <laughs> uh, attach winch. We're making an interesting corner here. There we go. Just beating the crap out of our trailer. But, uh, that's okay. Once we drop our materials off, we'll be, we won't have no more use for it. I don't generally like pull behind trailers like this. I feel like they drag trucks down. Uh, that's just my opinion. I could be completely wrong, but <laughs> I think they do. I just rather not use them. All right, truck, get up here. We're almost tone free. Whole white star, white western star is just doing just fine here. I do have the stock engine in it, so and just with the stock engines, most of the trucks are good with just those. There are a few exceptions. Uh, the Ford Seven, is it the Ford Seven Fifty? If I if I'm remembering that truck right, uh, it's an exception. Uh, a bigger engine in the old, in that uh, the F750 truck is very useful, and probably some other trucks, but I've never never actually uh, used upgraded engines really because of the more fuel consumption they use uh, that's just my personal uh, it's just my personal way of playing so might be a little underpowered but uh, usually the trucks most if not all the trucks in the game can uh, get the job done with the stock engines <clears throat> Right, we'll make a turn here. Okay. So we got one metal beam and one concrete slab. All right, stage completed. Got our framing done. So what we're going to do is detach this trailer, and I'm just going to delete this trailer. Now for newer players, on normal mode or hardcore mode, or hard mode rather, uh, you might want to keep these trailers and sell them to make extra money. But that's not what we're doing here. All right, now. We need another set of metal beams, so it's just right on top of the hill here where our Jeep is. Put our old truck in high, and we'll go get them real quick.
level back in. Sells a small little sideboard trailer. Alrighty. So we'll go down and uh, unload these metal beams. on the flock <laughs> Alrighty. Try to get in here. Our metal beams are unloaded. Now, we need concrete blocks, but if we look at the map, none is appearing anywhere. What we'll have to do, <clears throat> excuse me, to complete this bridge, we got to go back to Smithfield Dam. Okay, so we'll get our truck turned around. To Smithfield Dam we go. I will uh, keep everybody here with it. I'll keep it going so everybody knows uh, that way we know the path to go and to get our concrete blocks. It's not that far. Oh, come on, baby. There we go. Keep rolling our truck in high gear. We should have enough fuel, so we won't worry about that. <laughs> I know we're kind of on a slow track but I prefer using uh, like the higher gear just to take my time to prevent any unnecessary damage to your truck because going automatic, uh, a lot of times you're, the tires won't stick to the road and they'll just fly out from under you. And there you go, you'll be flipped over the guardrail. Uh, ask me how I know, because I have done it many times. There's our International Paystar, which we used in our last video. So if you haven't seen it, maybe check, go back and check that video out. to Smithfield Dam.
here we are. We'll exit out. Now we're going, actually, we're just going right down here to this little warehouse. And that should have our concrete blocks. I need to remember, we need blocks. a lot of times the mission won't appear once you go to a different map. <clears throat> Cargo management. Wooden planks, metal beams. Concrete blocks. And we'll, I believe it was only one. Let me check. Global map. Metal beams, one concrete block, so yes, we just need one. Always a good idea just to make sure. Because you don't want to get uh, one, like one set of concrete blocks and then get all the way back over, ooh, get all the way back over there and find out you needed like two or something so that wouldn't be good so we'll hop on back here pretty quick skip our scene We are back. So all we got to do is make it back to our bridge. We'll slow her down. Because these trailers, much like the trucks, can, can just go completely out of control and slide around. We don't want to lose our cargo. We'll use automatic as much as we can. If you like using automatic, I, you know, kind of feather the throttle, take your finger off the throttle every little bit to keep the truck and trailer under control. hit automatic keep it in the auto or all-wheel drive rather throughout this part so our truck can keep its momentum yes we are using a little bit more fuel but it's all right we don't have far to go so Here we are. Whoa, big rock. And our bridge is complete. Made some good money. 
Not a bad day's work. We'll shut down. So, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed this video. And we'll be be uploading maybe two, two or three videos per weekend. Uh, depends uh, how much, what else I got going on and how busy I am. As long as the weather is cooperating. <laughs> if the weather is rotten, then I can make uh, more videos than usual. But anyway, I'm going to stop rambling. I hope you all have a good day today. And have a good evening and stay safe out there. And we will see you next time on more SnowRunner New Game Plus. Goodbye, everyone.